Welcome back. We are here on eToro looking at the cryptocurrency market. And this is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, November 10th, 2020. And if you'd like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. We have a signal service on Patreon. You're welcome to join that. The link is down below. We already have over 40 traders there using our signal service. And you get access as well to the full technical analysis uh, for commodities. So uh, let's get to it. Let's see what happened today. And of course, there was a lot of volatility in the market today. However, Bitcoin did not get them that hammered as I did expect uh, Bitcoin to get. We um, we rallied, we went all the way down, but at this moment we are in the range of uh, 15,700 700 or 15,800 and then down towards uh, 14,800. So within a uh, uh, thousand uh, range here. At this point, I'm still waiting for a pullback towards the 50 moving average. We are very overextended for the 50 moving average. Um, it is expected this for this market to, uh, to go uh, lower from here. And as you can see on the technical indicators, they are also indicating that we are most likely going lower. The CCI has shown several uh, periods here of these gray shadows, which is um, a sign that this market is over bought or overstretched and we shouldn't expect a pullback whether or not it's a massive pullback or a, just a gradual grind towards the 15 moving average that is to be seen um, this is a, usually used to be much volatile than than is now but we can have moves similar to this one um, but we have to see at least it is too risky to enter this market at this point i would not uh, basically ask anybody to enter this at this point because it can break to the downside if you buy it you can also and then you get basically stuck here and if we if we uh, if you try to sell it can also rally from here to the very highest that is possible we have seen it before even in periods for example here when we were overstretched it rallied all the way up to uh, 15,000 almost 16,000 and and then had a pullback so Pull back towards the 50 moving average, at least around this area here, around 13,000, would be um, a buying opportunity. Uh, the best area to enter this market is right here at 12,474. That is the previous resistance area, and you would also run into the 50 moving average at the same time. But these indicators have to change course, and they have to be on the way up again. We are at the moment fairly overbought so anticipate a pullback for bitcoin so ethereum here so we rallied significantly last week we are trading a little bit sideways today we pulled back we rallied we pulled back it was basically all over the place um at this point technical indicators are turning around uh, especially the cci is turning around and that should be a warning you can see basically what happened last time it turned around is basically we rallied uh, we pulled back all the way down to the 50 moving average the same goes for this area here so cci is a very good indicator for uh, estimating when we basically have pullbacks and when we have rallies and it moves much faster than uh, for example the stochastic and also the rsi so um at this point we expect the, 50, the, the, the MACD to turn around, break the signal line, and head lower from here. So a possible entry would be here, 417. Um, and best entry would be here around 377, which is the 50 moving average. So no one's just basically buying this or selling this moment. You need a pullback in order to enter this market. Otherwise, it's just technically gambling so hope you found this video helpful you're welcome to subscribe hit the subscribe button in the corner hit the like button and the bell button in order to see a new video and you're welcome to go and join us or watch our patreon um, by clicking the link below so good luck and thank you very much